what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another gig log. Travis here. Today we're at Astrid Acres Inn for a wedding and we're in the wedding barn for not just the reception but also for the ceremony. There's no b-roll in this one. It's not gonna be fancy edited like some of the other ones. It's gonna be kind of like the last one you just watched. Uh, it's just gonna be kind of straight up old school how I used to do it. But I got some pretty cool uh, things to show you that's going on here in the barn. We're gonna have the ceremony in here, then we're gonna have a flip, and then we're gonna do the reception. There's some modifications I've made to my setup, some things that I actually forgot today, not a major, nothing major forgot. Uh, I just forgot the scrims for my speakers to make them white. So we're just gonna have to deal with that for to the, this wedding. But uh, I think you're gonna like the modification that I've done to the setup. I posted it on the DIY page and people ate it up. I've actually got, not to brag, but Chave, uh, they owe me some props, okay? Because I think because of my post, they have sold a total of 12 wash effects hexes for people to do exactly what I did with mine. Let's go check that out. So as you can see, the setup is over here kind of blockaded by chairs for the ceremony because this is what we got going on. It's really cold outside. It's about 30 degrees. That's not fun. But they got the heaters in here and these heaters, about six of them in here, they actually do a really good job. And as of right now, only five of them are on because we don't have this one on since it's close to my controller and my laptop and all that stuff. So modification one, these are Chave wash effects hexes that I have painted white with high heat paint to blend in with the system. I don't know why Chave has not given us a version of these yet but I think they look fantastic. Like I said, I posted it in the DIY group. People loved it. They ate it up and I've sold, thanks to that post, a total of 12 of these lights, not personally to other people, but they went on to whatever website they ordered from Amazon and ordered you know, two, two a piece and there's been six people do it so far. So yeah <laughs> chave i helped you out with some sales they're gonna void the warranty as soon as i open the box just so you know though down here i know this is a chaotic mess but this is not how it's going to look all night we have the microphone system that's typically on my ceremony rig We're rocking it through here and it's actually plugged in to my external mixer so they can have good microphone sound here in the barn we also got the laptop here in a different spot. So liking the standalone look, because it doesn't have the laptops everywhere uh, visible. So instead of like spending a ton of money on a new controller, because I love my 1000, I have convertible laptops. So I just flipped it and I think it looks pretty dope. It's really easy to use. If I need to search for anything, I can just pop up the on-screen keyboard, get rid of it if I don't need it. And I use the mouse for everything else when it comes to browsing, but and I use the controller for the actual DJing portion of it. And then we got the Maui 28 G2s. I forgot my white scrims for them, so we're just gonna rock them in black tonight. I thought they were in my bag, but come to find out, they weren't. So, oh well, not a big deal, not a tragedy. Now, I know you're probably thinking, so I've only got one laptop, so that must mean that I'm running DMX and virtual DJ on that one laptop? And the answer is no. I'm not running any DMX at all. And I'm honestly thinking about going to not running DMX anymore. The Wash FXs are a fantastic light. They're extremely versatile. Yeah, they might be a beginner light, but you know what? They work. They do their job. They wash the dance floor. And that's something I've been wanting to go to is just a main dance floor wash opposed to the spots. Spots are cool, but they're only really effective when you got haze or fog. And the vast majority of not just venues but couples either don't want them or the venue won't let you use them so i'm going more towards the wash lighting than ever before so that's why we did the wash effects hexes in white since chave wouldn't give it to us i pulled the trigger and did it myself i'm pretty sure i avoided the warranty it's the best feeling I've 